warten. Yeah. Popularity number six. Sorry, I had to celebrate some arbitrary social media stuff. Fuck, I tried to get too fancy. Wait, that's it? Hey, you go. You're fine. Maybe there's different levels of car wash. How much do I owe you? $150, just like everybody else for some reason. Maybe somebody will, at some point will ask me about like a, a different type of car wash. I feel like... I feel like Amy needs a neighbor. Mayumi or Maria? They've both got a level three in fueling. One cleaning. Cash register repairing. I think we go Mayumi. Let's see. Work Born here. I'm working. Born in Florida, Mayumi has experience working in the service industry. She's worked at gas stations before. Currently, she lives in Texas away from her family with a few of her friends. She notes in her interest that she's a fond love, she is fond of rodeo, sharpshooting, and derby. She notes having been a respectable player on her school sports team. Her CV has her place of birth underlined seven times. She notes that she greatly dislikes people making assumptions of her heritage based purely on her ethnicity. Her full name barely fits into the required field on her resume. Maria is an ex-pop star from Europe, having toured her continent for the span of around nine years. An unfortunate throat injury has put her in convalescence. But by the time she was able to sing again, everyone had already moved on, save from her most die-hard fans. Maria is noted to seek work to become fully self-sufficient and remain more or less incognito. Bent on cutting all ties from her previous life, her actual work experience is questionable, however. I'm going to go with Miami. Two shifts. We figure this out. Miami's gonna work nights. And her primary car job is gonna be to fuel cars, and her secondary will be to handle the register. We'll pay her automatically. Close. 
super. Super. Yo. No worries. I feel like I've done that thing where I've really lost track of time. How long have I been playing? about to be 11. I was worried we'd be stranded. Right. And this once my unit gets a chance to show us what she can do, I think. Pretty much what I asked for. Good. We aim to please. Cool. Oh, fuck you, fuck you. already made back nice the day. investment on the trailer. Money is just rolling in for us now. I owe you one. Do I want to get a bigger parking lot? You've been here for days. You're gonna starve to death. Can I do? And I guess as long as you're not in the way. Yeah, you keep an eye on that motherfucker, Amy. You are a big spender though, aren't you? I'm sorry for talking all kinds of shit for you just because you sold Joe Biden glasses. Great job. $24. Nah, fuck you actually. You just got a lot of stuff. A lot of cheap ass shit. Oh my god, there's so many of you, same person. I don't know. I guess it's not like the right thing to do to uh, wait until I fuck somebody's car up. Fun. I owe you one. 
there's so many. Be there in a second. go over budget. Awesome. Um, Features. Seven fifty for rear parking. Got him. I'm supposed to be breaking into cars again? Need you to handle the register.
I can't pick your car. I've got a minute. I have one minute to, to finish this. One trunk, one more trunk. Don't mind me, I'm just testing. Part of our service is to test your trunk. Whew, I ain't getting my ass beat today. Your trunk works great. You should be happy. Ah, fuck you, you paid me $40. You think you don't have to pay because you got more? You're doing great. She got to work on her first day. She's zooming through these registers. $18. Woo. be back. I could sell so many hats, y'all. What kind of hats do the people buy? You watched it. Uh, y'all hear that? She's making mistakes. Let's 
all my money. Too late. Yeah. I <laughs> gotta keep a dentist to turn around anyway. Fuel is low. We got a garage customer. Same tire as everybody else. All right, we're gonna do this. We're gonna check on our buddy down in the sewer. And we're gonna call it a night for gas station simulator. I'm gonna at least look at the Fortnite shop. I think I might play a round. We'll see. You're all scratched up. Uh-huh. Did it? Pressure's about to be in the yellow. You're a lifesaver. <laughs> Gustav! Eat up, buddy.
Yes, ma'am. That's what we strive for here at Shits. Why are you just standing there and not filling up these cars? How much do I owe you? Is it because you know that we're out of fuel? Here. The smell is horrible. It's hard to quit. There's so much to do. You're going to die here. Cause you, nobody has a reverse in the desert, I guess. Here we are. Running low on alcohol. the malfunction. These all really suck. Thousand dollars I can upgrade the workshop again. And for fifteen hundred I can upgrade the car wash. Okay. Thank you. 
I wonder what the red and the blue, red and green dots mean. Maybe I get up to five hundred dollars. And uh we hire a third employee and then we call it a night. Oh my god, every tire on your car is fucked up at once. Yeah, we can build another. All right, we got Nina or Ricardo. He's level three in everything. He's by far the best employee that we've seen. And he's cheaper. His, his rates are lower than hers. Nina uh, makes it abundantly clear that her reason for applying to your gas station was its proximity to Homey Airport, also known as Area 51. Her work experience is limited, but she is noted to have an exuberant enthusiasm. She has had noise complaints filed against her in the past, but she has never had police officially stage any intervention. She is a poor sleeper, Averaging about four hours of sleep per night were the same. She is likable in conversation, though her topics are full of conspiracy theories and other eccentricities. She believes aliens will come to save the Earth in the year 2077. Ricardo, once a famous sports star, Ricardo has fallen on hard times. His career was seriously damaged by allegations of unsportsmanlike behavior based on popular internet rumor turned into viral joke. By this point, he has given up on pursuing sp sports further, declaring his career ultimately downed in flames. Due to his fame, he is unable to take more prestigious jobs in fear of attracting unwanted attention. His work ethic is more or less entirely unknown. We're going to find out. He seems like he's a pretty good hire, plus we already got two women. We got to keep it diverse around here. He's going to be on night shift, day shift. I'm going to have him repairing cars and fueling cars while Amy does the register and cleans the station. I'm pretty good about it. I'm stuck though. All oh, my hands aren't on the right buttons. Ooh. 
Well, that's going all going to be it for Gas Station Simulator tonight. Join us next time. We'll see how well our employees work together. I probably need to repaint the sun bitch. Thanks to Dennis. As usual. Oh. Also, it just needs paint. What the fuck is this? Ricardo, you're already here, man. I do want to. You didn't. You don't quite look like your picture. Let's get you auto paid so you don't quit on me like Amy did that one time. And also, you're not gonna do very good at mechanicing. If I don't get you all stocked up. sure you're gonna do a bang up job before somebody shows up as soon as you go fill up cars well that's all the time we got tonight for gas station simulator next time we'll see how well our employees are working together we we'll make sure to keep Gustav nice and fed. And we'll answer the age-old question. Are the party, party bus people uh, crazy people? Or are they actually aliens? That'll do. They're crazy alien people. Top of the line job there. You damn right. And also, when we come back, we'll see if this uh, is a skeleton inside a gremlin. You doing great. Y'all are doing great. Let's give it a save.